Hey guys, today we're going to be showing you guys the process of removing and replacing your extractor. We're going to be replacing this with the Alpha Wolf 9mm extractor. This is from Lone Wolf. I already have it here in this Glock, but we're just going to go over the process on how to do it. First thing, the only tool that you're going to need is a Glock tool. First thing you want to do is remove your mag and make sure your gun is clear. This gun is clear and then you're going to break it down. You can go ahead and take your frame, place it off the side because you're not going to need it. Now you're going to go ahead and take your slide. First thing you want to do is go ahead up here, right here, and you're going to try to push this piece up and then you're going to push down on your spacer sleeve, which is right in there. So you're going to take this and press down and while you're doing that you're going to place your thumb on the back plate and you're going to slide down and you want to make sure your thumb stays over that because there's a spring in there and if you don't put your thumb there it's going to shoot out across the room so now that it came down you can release it there's your spring and plunger and then there's your firing pin assembly so you just want to remove that completely and that's going to pop out first thing you want to do is pull out your firing pin assembly here very carefully and there that is. And while this is taken apart, you can do a nice clean of the whole setup as well. Set that off to the side. And then you're going to go ahead and take your spring and plunger out. And you can set that off to the side as well. So next, all you're going to do is push down on the firing pin safety, which is right here. And that will release your extractor. So you're just going to press down on that. And then if you rotate just like that, it dropped. And it is right here. So as you can see, it came out and it just falls right out once you depress that firing pin safety. And then from there, if you wanted to, you can pull the rest of that out. And there should be a little spring right there. And that is the firing pin safety spring. It should be stuck on there. If it does not come out with it, pull it out and then make sure you put that back in to the firing pin safety. Now all I have to do is to put it back together is do the opposite. You're going to take your firing pin safety, place it back into the slot, depress it, and then while it is depressed, you're going to take your extractor here and you're going to slide it in just like that. And then you can stop depressing that and that locks it right into place. And it really is that simple to replace that. Uh, you just press that down, put a new one in, and uh, it locks. All right, to put the rest back together, you're going to take your spring and plunger, drop it in, and then you're going to take your firing pin assembly and carefully put it back into the slide and then push down. Now you're going to take your back plate, slide in as much as it can, and then you're going to take either your finger, which I find that it's easier to use the tool, and you want to start your back plate in just enough to where it goes in like that, and then you're going to take the tool and press down on your firing pin assembly just right here on the corner until you can push that up and that's going to lock that into place and then you're going to take the tool press down on the plunger and push it in the rest of the way and then it's going to lock in just like that and that is exactly how you guys take out and replace your extractor very simple very easy to do um, not too many parts to take out and uh, each part is actually really easy to do all right, so if you're wondering, the slide work on this was done by Jaeger Works. They did an absolutely fantastic job. We're gonna be in a red dot here soon, but I just have to stop sometimes and admire the work they did on this. Then you can go ahead and put your gun back together after you're done admiring your gun. And then you're gonna do some function tests. Make sure everything works how it should. And it does. And there you go guys, that's exactly how you replace your extractor. I wanna thank Lone Wolf for sending us this for the Spartan 19. Uh, we also have their connector, which we have another video we previously posted about that if you're interested in, in getting one of those. Um, it's right here, their connector. We have that on this as well. These two are gonna be going on our new polymer 80s that we are building as well. 
Uh, make sure you guys go check out Lone Wolf if you're interested in this. They have some other products and parts that they have. Uh, we're going to put a link to their website in the description. Make sure you guys check out our sponsor, USA Gun Bunker. He has done a lot for us and he's an awesome guy. So make sure you guys go check him out and give some business. Check us out on Instagram at tactical underscore advisor. We do a lot more on there as well. And then like, comment, subscribe here. We really appreciate it, guys. Thank you.